Three years, fifty-four million, close to fifty-four million. Uh, this could be being reported for Craig Kimbrell going over to the Chicago Cubs, and uh, I like this move. It gives strength to the Cubs bullpen. Um, and I like Kimbrell ever since his uh, days uh, as being a closer for the Padres. Uh, you know, he was better as a Brave, you might say. Uh, you know, he's been with been with a few teams along the way. He wasn't uh, long with the pods, but still solid. Uh, you know, by the way, those Padres always had solid closers, including Kimbrel. Um, has he been average since uh, since the All Star break last year? And listen, not everyone is a hundred uh, perfect one hundred percent of the time in baseball. Baseball is a very humbling sport. Remember this, guys. I'd say he's been good more than he's been extremely average. Okay, three seven one ERA, one point three four two WHIP, three point nine one uh, FIP, four blown saves, and a postseason ERA over eight since the second half of last season. No, sure, you know, he's average for one half of one season. That does not define his whole career. And I never said that his last, uh, his, you know, that his last half of the last year wasn't average. He's been good for the most part of his career. Listen. How many guys, if you're saying to me, listen, how many guys over 30 who are flamethrowers continue to be dominant? Like maybe a couple of guys ever, a couple of guys ever paying a career for past performances is dumb, you might say. Well, I would agree with you with that statement, but that's not the way baseball works. He's definitely not the Kimbrel of the past, but the Cubbies saw something in him. Not sure I would have given him that payday, but I'm sure think that he has some gas in the tank for for three more years to be somewhat decent, if not still good. Listen, they're paying him $43 million, okay? If you think about it, okay, even though I wouldn't give that type of money, in the grand scheme of things, top uh, top tier relievers that's not a lot. Chapman makes 18, Jansen makes 17, Davis 17, Miller 12 and a half, Morrow 9, Cologne 7 and a half. Paying a Hall of Fame closer 14 million, coming off of a pretty good season, even if it's not up to his standards, looks like a bargain. Listen. Yes, okay, let me let me rephrase that. He's making ten this year, sixteen in the next two. With you know, an average of fourteen, okay. Nah, my math is not the greatest here. But listen. Uh, just I'll leave you a stat, okay? Uh, I'll leave you uh, with a stat here uh, in regards to uh, Kimbrel, and uh, Kimbrel has had some time to kind of wear. If you're wor worrying about what happened last year, the postseason, he's had some time to wear off that rust, and I'm sure uh, he's been keeping himself um, in shape. Here's uh, Kimbrel versus the 2019 Cubs bullpen career stats. BB per nine. Kimbrough, three and a half. Bullpen for the Cubs, 4.8. K's per BB, 4.23. Cubs bullpen, 1.29. K's per nine. Kimbrough, 14.7. Cubs bullpen, 8.9. I rest my pace. Uh, <laughs> I, I rest my case. Hope all is well. Look forward to speaking to you guys very, very soon.